Good morning, guys. It is bright out here. Uh, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Tina. So today we are headed to the Greek Orthodox Church in Randolph, New Jersey for their rummage sale. I went last year, wasn't sure if I was gonna go back. Uh, I did find a set of Ralph Lauren. If you guys remember, if you were watching me back then, um, I found a set of Ralph Lauren uh, luncheon plates, I believe they were, and mugs. Uh, kind of funny because they had the number of pieces that were supposed to be in the set and I knew that they weren't all there. Uh, I forget how it was worded. Maybe it was like mugs and cups were separate numbers on the on the paper or whatever. I'd have to rewatch the video. Anyway, I knew the set was not all there. And I remember, you know, in the comments, some people were like, oh no, you know, it was missing. Some people were like, oh no, you have this many mugs, this, so this is what it was supposed to be. I can't remember exactly how it went down, but I knew that the set was missing some pieces. So. I ran into a viewer at a sale uh, over the summer and she actually told me that her friend bought the other pieces. I think there were like four other pieces that her friend bought, mugs or something. So I just thought that was hysterical. I knew I was missing some, but I still did really, really well with the pieces that I did bring home. Uh, I, I made several hundred on the mugs and the plates. So it was a really good pattern. Uh, anyway, that was basically like my major score there. So am I going to find that again? Doubtful. You never know what's being donated to these rummage sales. Um, but I'm hoping to find something juicy. I'll tell you that much. So I am excited to go check it out. Uh, glad it's not raining this morning. It rained all night long. Uh, so yeah, let's go check out this rummage sale and see what we can find for resale today. Let's go. All right, the line is already looking pretty long. And I think I forgot my bags. I think I have a couple small bags in here. It's not going to be great at all. Holy macaroni. I can't believe I forgot to grab other bags. Thing. That's not even a bag. That's a. Oh my goodness. It's a case to like something. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. Well, no, it's kind of. I think it's a little bit different. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Bloomingdale's. Always like a Bloomingdale's box. Should check out the dinnerware. It's nice new. That little turtle. Oh my goodness. I lucked out with dinnerware last time. Oh, flatware. Welcome. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I don't even know what that is that I just put in my bag. <laughs> Sambuca ice bucket. That's actually really neat. I brought a bigger bag. Whimsical cupboard. It's very crazy. I normally don't pick those up. Is a dollar? I might grab that. I don't know. It's kind of Dresden like, but yet it's not Dresden, so I don't know. I think I'll put that back. American candle. Oh, this looks like Anthro, it is. I'm talking to myself. I'm talking to myself. I am. 
thanks for letting me know. <laughs> Can I leave this bag here? What's your name? Tina. I'm gonna borrow this bag too, if that's okay. Thank you. All right, got a new bag to fill. Gingerbread. These are very nice. Service for 12. I don't know what the. Might be that Arcarock. Rock. Right, I think I'm gonna get out of this aisle. Everybody's going crazy. This looks like that Joe Roy pattern, but it isn't. be paid for Skechers $20. I remember they had this expensive shoe section last year. Michael Kors, Ralph Lauren, Tory Burch, those are 30. Oh, but they're like new. Oh boy. I think we are gonna get those. Gap. This is a really nice pair. Fifteen on this, Tory Burch. Okay. Do can I pay for you? Yeah. Pay you? For everything over here. here. So are you finished? Oh, you know what? I don't know. Okay. Yep. I'm gonna get these two for sure. Yep. That would be great. I'm just gonna take another quick look here. What is the goblet? Is this? It was tangled already. I was just trying to move this. Yeah. Well, yeah, I was going to fix it. Yes, I'll take these. Oh, look at that one. Okay, I'm gonna pay you for those two okay. things. So that's 45, I believe. Can I leave it here until I'm done shopping? Yes. Okay. Here you go. That should be exact. Just double check, make yes. sure I didn't give you too many 20s. I did that a couple days ago, I think. <laughs> um, Lane, but there's only one piece. No. So, Tina. Tina. Tina, yep. Okay, so I'm good then. I'm going to go shop. Thank you. All right, back, back to it. A bunch of stamps. We got enough stamps. a nice Tory birch bag. I hope hope the inside's not destroyed and I didn't check well enough. Let's check out the shoes. He's definitely a little steep, but I think they'll do okay. I want to check out the tables a little bit more. This feels like cashmere. Lord and Taylor cashmere. It's $10, but I think I'm going to get it. Cashmere 
actually does pretty well. Ooh. What is this? I don't know. Charter Club. Tommy Hilfiger. Try not to put my bag in front of the camera. Ralph Lauren Sport. Six dollars. Bright blue. It's like a older style. Candies. Eight dollars. They look kind of like Y2K-ish. But do I want to spend eight dollars? I don't know. I think I'll revisit the jeans and stuff in a few minutes. I think I'm going to go check out the hard goods again. St. Lucia. Cute little bag. Alright, you guys know me. I'm all over the place. Oh, I totally missed the toys. I wish I could be everywhere at once. Game without decency. I don't know how much the games are. I don't know now because it's sealed. And it sounds interesting. I'll try to scan that before I leave. back through the holiday stuff on this side. Ooh, this looks like, um, what do you call, who am I thinking of? I forget who I'm thinking of that this is, but I'm going to get this. This looks like Jim Shore. I'm not sure if it is. I am going to get this. It's not branded. Mm. Can't get this open. I how much that is. Christmas animals. Oh, this is um, Blue Sky Heather Gold Mink. I've never seen the ornaments. I think I'll put that in my bag. This is pretty. New England Twall. box under here. I'm trying to see what it was, but I can't lift it. This is Lennox. I think it's Lennox. My glasses are on. Oh yeah. Russian cross. Kind of neat. Heather Gold Mink. I have wanted one of these for the door in my warehouse. I think I'm going to get this. Arrow 
garden spot LED. Ooh. Is that just the light? I don't know. Let me give that a little scan. See what that shows up as. Oh, maybe it's like the actual like Arrow Garden 1899 2399 1092 and they want ten dollars for it. I think we're leaving that. Put that back. Look through here, it's just different toiletries by the looks of it. These do not sell. Or if they do, they take forever. I might still have some listed. Doesn't have a lot of over. Oh, I think I did go down this side already. <laughs> this is cute. Oh, that's heavy. Seen that brand before? That's that's really heavy. Whipped cream maker. Hmm. Let's see what that looks like. Ooh, that's a nice color. Let me get that. Four bucks. Mm, some travel mugs down here. Oh, this one's really nice. I like that. Lady in the Tramp, but that looks like it's in a different language. Bunch of NASCAR mugs. Mannerisms. These are so cool. They look like they might be a little discolored though. They feel around this area. Okie dokie. I should check out the jewelry. I know you guys always yell at me, but I think it's probably come through. Hmm. It's a very vintage pillow kit. I might try that. Random, random assortment. I don't know why that's there. Kind of 
nice. But I'm sure it won't sell for much. some of the clothing. Let's see if we can find anything unique. I'm gonna go back to the racks first. It's just stuff that's a little pricier, but that's okay. Check it out. Maybe this one we didn't go through. Charter Club. Get three dollars. I don't think those are new. They're in with the new section. Talbot size small. Nice little cardigan. Eight dollars. Hmm. Maybe we'll keep looking. Look, this doesn't even have a tag, and it's in the new section. This one's been cut out. All right, Rothschild. Those jackets can do really well. $25. Nope. All right, we're going to hit the table. The table clothes. <laughs> Dojos usually do pretty well. Well, they used to. I don't know if they're still doing okay, but we're going to grab these. Definitely going to grab those. That looks like it shrunk. White House Black Market. Let's see if we have any more dojos over here. It's a pretty sweet find. Dana Buckman. Mmm. Like we have another pair of seven for all mankind. These look like they are shorts. And I don't think the shorts really sell. I don't think anybody's gonna wear those. I haven't found a pair of dojos in years. I'm gonna have to really look those up. I actually think I saw the pair listed in my Poshmark closet. But they had a very short inseam, so I think that's why they didn't sell. Citizens of Humanity. I don't think these sell anymore either. Kirkland. I think that came from Costco, maybe. You guys, before you get bent out of shape, this is a rummage sale. People are supposed to rummage through these clothes. So it looked like a mess before I even got here. See? <laughs> these actually feel like um, bark cloth, which is weird. Well, I guess they are like swim shorts. They do feel like bark cloth. 
or box. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. I'm gonna put those in my bag for now. American Eagle, super high rise jegging, 14. here. Oh, I kind of like these colors. It's petite, small. Ralph Lauren. I really like these bright colors, though. I think I'm going to get that, even though it's a petite, small. It's probably one of the hardest sizes in the history to sell. How you doing, Joel? You find anything good? Um, oh, nice. Okay. That's not bad. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Look at this. This is so cool. It's Ralph Lauren, but it's a petite small. So you know I'll have that forever. But I, I, I really like the colors of it. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe not my best find, but it's still pretty cool. All right. Let's see here. It's a decent brand, but that shirt looks pretty old. All right, I don't think I'm going to find anything in the men's section. Maybe I'll check out some of the linens here. And I think we're going to leave pretty soon. been in here quite a while. Ooh, 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 ooh. Totally, totally just lost that out of the bag. It's kind of like really vintage looking. But I don't think it is vintage, but it's really cool. I don't know why, but I do like this. It's going to be a pain to list. Because I can tell it's huge. I might have a little spot here and there. I'm, I'm putting this back. I'm not getting this. I kind of want to. What the heck is this? No idea what that is. Yeah, I think Alright, I don't think there's only one of these that sold and it was international. I don't think it's going to be the best pickup in the world. So for $4, I think I am going to go put it back. colors. Let me get that. Not sure why. Okay guys, so I am all checked out. Uh, I spent $35 on all of the stuff in the bags and then the shoes were $30 um, but I think they'll do okay. They look um, they were $2.95, then they were sold at Nordstrom Rack for $1.79. They are new, so I should be able to at least get like maybe $90, $100 for them, I'm thinking. Um, fingers crossed. Uh, and then I got the bag for $15. The only other thing that I purchased afterwards off camera ended up being um, a Royal Albert 
tea, mini tea set that I that I noticed um, in like the boutique kind of area. So I ended up paying twenty dollars for that. Um, that's all right here. It's all wrapped up, so I'm not going to dig it out. But I'll try to pop a comp up on the screen so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Let's look in this bag, this Tory Birch bag. I said, oh no, what if it's like, oh no, it's like really, really good condition for 15 bucks. So I think that was a, I think that was a good deal. Not sure what I'll make on it. Um, anyway, so then the only other thing I bought was a $25 raffle ticket for the Mercedes that they have sitting out front, which they're going to raffle, I think in two weeks. Um, so that was $25. Uh, it's a 2023 Mercedes. We'll stop and check it out on the way out of here. Um, I told the man, I said, I'll be back for it. I'll be back to drive it away. So we'll see what happens. <laughs> so, uh, I didn't enter the raffle last year. I figured I would try it this year. Now there was a vase that I did not notice until I stopped filming. There was a Czechoslovakian vase in the boutique area. It was beautiful. It almost uh, looked like Lalique. It had like a frosted kind of um, like area to it. Um, but someone else swooped in and got it right, literally right as I was going to ask to see it. Someone else bought it for $25. And the lady told me it was here last year and no one wanted it. And I totally didn't even see it last year. Sometimes when there's so much to look at, you don't see things. Um, it was beautiful and I think it might be worth quite a bit. I'll see if I can find a photo of a similar one to show you guys what I'm talking about. Uh, anyway, let's hop in the car and go check out the Mercedes that I'm going to win. Okay, so this is the car that is up for raffle. This is not, this is not a reseller mobile, right? Like there's no way, there's not enough room. Uh, my friend Michelle actually has a very similar car. This looks like just kind of like the base model, I think. I'm not sure. Like, I feel like the inside of my friend's car looks a little more fancy. You guys probably can't see. There we go. Maybe if I put it right on the glass, you can see the inside of this car. Oh, I don't know, though. Hey, listen. I will take this bad boy home. And my daughter will probably take it from me. <laughs> my daughter be rolling back up to uh, college in this ride. I could see it now. It's pretty de pretty decent car. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, look at this. I'm not, I'm not a red fan though. I don't know. I'm gonna win this car. This car is gonna be my car. She's putting it out there in the universe, guys. You heard it here. <laughs> All right. Back, back in my baby over here. <laughs> she needs a wash, look at this, look at this. All right, guys, so that was fun. Um, that's gonna wrap up this video. <laughs> oh, I'm cracking myself up. Um, cracking myself up. Anyway, that's gonna wrap up this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please give me a thumbs up, comment, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already, and hit that little bell button so you get notifications every time I upload. And until next time, bye.